what's up guys just finished that pool workout uh, that was pool workout three uh, of this new program so I'll take you through it quickly um, I should be doing five by five on deadlifts but I felt very very strong today so I decided to go for a you know kind of a top set um, did I hit 190 or did I fail 190? I think I failed 190 but then I hit 180 for eight reps that's a PB blown out of the way uh, I can believe I got 180 for eight reps anyway Moving on, I was absolutely blasted after that. It really taxed my central nervous system, so the rest of it was a hard, hard session. But this is how every single session will go on my back days for the next four to five weeks. Uh, three or four weeks now, because it's already been two weeks. So I start off with, excuse me, look at my phone, just for reference. Uh, dumbbell pedley rows, um, pendley rows, sorry. What you do is grab a flat bench so you can face forward. Strap, I always use straps so you can feel your back more. Um, and then you just work up and wait, you go 15 reps, 12 reps, 10 reps, and then eight reps. I've been increasing by 2.5 kilos every single week since I've been doing this. So I'm very, very happy about that. Uh, just four sets there, moved on to five sets of lat pull down, close grip. Keep the, less, lot, the rest a lot lower than the rest of the workout, uh, just because I really want to focus on just squeezing the lats out. And also, I feel like I'm pretty wide anyway, so I'm more about bringing the detail in and, and kind of more high rep, high intensity. So started off on 70 to 15 reps, 80 to 12 reps, 85 to 10 reps, 90 to 8 reps and dropped it to 50 to 20 reps. Notice how I go up in pyramids, progressively getting heavier, progressively getting heavier. Uh, again, I'm putting the weight up at least 5 every single, every single session I do. If I can't do the extra 5 and I'm just not strong enough, I'll do 1 or 2 more reps every single session. I will get 1 more rep, 1 more stack up, 1 more weight up, whatever it has to do. It's always going up, no matter what. Uh, moved into a one-arm cable pull-down, just 10 reps there. Um, started off on level 13, because I did level 13 for one set last week. It was too hard, so I only did eight reps there. So I went back down to my normal weight, which is level 12, um, on the cable machines that we have here, and I hit that for 12 reps every set. So the week before I hit 10 reps every set, I managed to force out six extra reps over the four sets. So that is progression from last week. Moved on to um, a seated row of any variation superset with erector raises. Um, I've been doing these erector raises with some heavy weight now just to try to build my lower back as you guys know from the last video. Um, so what have you got to do to bring out a weak part? You've got to train it more than anything, train it heavier, train it faster, train it longer. So that's what I've been doing with my erectors. I currently do them twice a week, these erector raises. I try to get some heavy weight in there and sometimes I'll do some lighter weight just to kind of get a pump. Um, did it with a seated cable machine, which is just my right hand one looking that way. Um, just another little variation I haven't tried before, so wanted to try it out. Um, you, it's important to get freedom in your workout because you will get bored. You can be like a robot and do everything the same thing, progressively overload every single week. But I honestly believe as long as you've got three or four staple exercises that you're progressively overloading, you will grow. Um, and then the variety will just keep the body guessing as well. Um, finally, moved into a back superset of choice. Again, this is about variety. Today I did low, um, bent over rows and the uh, cable pull throughs. Always do cable pull throughs just to get a lap pump at the end. Really fires up, up my lap, upper lats and just wanted to squeeze from the barbell row uh, at the end. Really intense workout. You've got to keep the, the heart rate high. You've got to keep you know, the sets, uh, the rest between sets low. It's all about Punch, pushing as much blood into the muscle as you can, breaking down the muscle fibers and regrowing for the next session um, where more progression will happen every single week. Progression will happen. You'll see the next back workout video I do, I will put my Evernote. In fact, I'll do it right now. Right now on screen, you are seeing week one back workout. You'll know all of these uh, weights that I've done. And right now, next to it, you've got uh, session two, and you see the progression right there, whether it's the weight that's gone up, you'll see in brackets I've got how I felt on each set, how if one set, the one week was hard, the next week is probably gonna be easy, and that's the trend that's been following so far. So, you know, going through my notes right now, you can see the progression that I've made physically um, and generally mentally as well, because if I go back and I see the note that says this set was easy last time, I know that I'm going up in weight. If I go up and I say, and if I go up to a set and I say, see that this set was very, very hard last week, I'm in there to make it easy as possible. I'm gonna pull that shit as hard as I can and I'm gonna make sure it's easier than last week. And if it's too easy, the weight's going up. So make sure you're progressing just like I am right now. If it's not with the weight, it's with the reps. If it's not with the reps, then it's, you know, maybe you can throw on an extra set of just even four or five reps. As long as you're doing more reps or more weight than you did the previous week, you will progress, guys. 
thank you very much for watching. Uh, I absolutely love this session, so give it a go. Let me know how you get on. And you know, if, if you're doing the same programs, if you're doing the same things I'm doing right now, trying to gain weight, trying to build muscle, let me know what you're doing. You know, comment down in the, in the comment section. And you know, let, let's, let's, let's talk about this. Let's, let's learn from each other. You know, I can learn as much from you guys as you can from me. So, peace everybody. Thanks for watching. We'll see you guys in the next one.